Hello everybody and welcome back to Advanced Maths. Today we're looking at mixed numbers and improper fractions. So I've got an example of this here for you, where I've got 2 and 3 quarters and 11 quarters. The 2 and 3 quarters is a mixed number, the 11 quarters is an improper fraction. Improper fraction just means it's heavier on the top. It's a bigger number on the top. A mixed number is where it's a number and a fraction. It's mixed. I've also got these uh, circles down here, where I've got two whole circles and three quarters. That's two and three quarters. But also, if you count the quarters in all these circles, there are 11 quarters. And so it's also 11 quarters. So, this amount in the blue circles can be represented as 2 and 3 quarters, or 11 quarters. It's the same thing. So you can either write a fraction as a mixed number or an improper fraction. And these are two ways of writing fractions that are bigger than 1. Let's see another example. Here I've got one whole and two-thirds. One and two-thirds. I've also got one, two, three, four, five thirds. So I can write it as five thirds as well. Okay. Now let's imagine we wanted to go from a mixed number to an improper fraction. The rule is we multiply the three by the five here, that's big number by the denominator, and then we add the 4. 3 times 5 is 15, plus the 4 is 19. The bottom number stays the same, the denominator stays the same. So it will be 19 fifths. Let's see that again. We do the big number times the denominator. 5 times 10 is 50, plus 1 is 51 over 10. The bottom number stays the same here. Okay? Remember, for all of these, the bottom number will stay the same. Now let's go the other way. Improper fractions to mixed numbers. 13 halves. For this, we do the top number divided by the bottom number. 13 divided by 2 is... 6 remains a 1. You can see this with these sweets over here. I split them into two equal piles of 6 with a remainder of 1. So we write 6 as a big number and then 1 as the numerator over 2. The bottom number stays the same. Now we've got 23 over 4. 23 quarters. We do 23 divided by 4 is 5 remainder 3. So it looks like this, 5 and 3 quarters, the 4 on the bottom remains the same. And that's how you convert improper fractions to mixed numbers. I've got some practice questions for you here. The 6 over here I want you to make into improper fractions, and the 6 over here I want you to make into mixed numbers. Take your time and pause the video now and see how many of these you can get right. Pause the video, and when you're ready, I'll reveal the answers in three, two, one. Did you get them right? Please let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching this week's video from Advanced Maths. We have far more videos occurring every week that cover GCSE, IB, A-level, and key stage 3 maths. Thanks for watching and good luck in your exams.